Hello friends, welcome back to the video tutorial of WooCommerce AliExpress dropship. Today in this video, I am going to explain you how to import products from AliExpress and how to place orders for those products accordingly to the AliExpress website. First of all, you need to install the Chrome extension for our plugin that is WordPress AliExpress dropship plugin to your Chrome browser. So you have to install the Chrome extension that is WooCommerce AliExpress importer to your Chrome browser and after installing the extension you can see that this blue button will get enabled on the AliExpress website. Now the user has to just click on this button to import the product from Aliexpress to his web store. But before that the user has to configure his web store to Aliexpress. Now in starting when you click on this blue button you will have to configure your store here but as I have already configured my store settings here so I will tell you how to configure the store settings so I will click on this update button and now here you can see you have to add your store URL here now in, in starting when you click on product to import you will get this option where you have to authenticate your store so you have to provide your store URL here now after entering your store URL you have to click on the next button now here you have to add the username and the token these details can be found in the dropship settings of the from the admin panel of your website so you have to go to the admin panel of your website under dropship settings you can find these details so let's get back to the admin panel of the plugin that is WooCommerce AliExpress dropship here under warehouse management you can see the option dropship settings here you can see the username here as webcool and the token as webcool123 these are the settings that will be implemented on the products imported from aliexpress so let's say the default category for the products imported from aliexpress will be accessories which i have selected you can also select as aliexpress products clothing sorry friends i have selected accessories now the default product stock for the products imported from aliexpress on my web store will be 50 you can also add the stock as per your reference let's say i've added 40. the default status of the product will be published the default product visibility i have selected as shop and search results so the product will show in both the shop and in search results also the default product warehouse i have selected warehouse 2 so all the products imported from aliexpress will get automatically assigned to this warehouse the default product price configuration i have selected as same as aliexpress so all the products imported from aliexpress will have the same price on my store as well now save these aliexpress settings and now you have to copy the detail username and token to authenticate your store on aliexpress so now go on the aliexpress website now enter your username and token details here so let's say my username is webcool and the token is webcool123 now click on the submit button now you can see the store has been successfully authenticated 
now your store is been successfully authenticated so you can import products to your store from aliexpress now to import product to your store you can click on any product and then click on this blue button now click on the submit button now you can see that the product is being shipped to your store successfully now you can add another product so click on this product now again click submit and you can see the message product imported successfully you can also add as many as products you want in your store and now let's go to the admin panel of your website where we can see the products imported successfully and we have to see all the details of the products there so let's see all the product details let's go into the admin backend panel of your website and under aliexpress We have the option here products now here you can see the products imported from aliexpress will be seen here now you can see product imported to your web, web store successfully so we have imported the product this product this product is automatically been assigned to the respective warehouse with the same product size and we have set the default quantity as 40 so you can see that the default quantity of the product in our store has been added to 40 now the admin can also select a warehouse here to see all the products assigned to that particular warehouse let's say I have selected warehouse 2 now here you can see all the products assigned to this warehouse and you can see this is the product we have just imported from aliexpress and this is the second product we have imported from aliexpress and the default quantity is 40 here now you can see the aliexpress products have been successfully imported to your web store now the admin can see the products in the front end of his website also where the products have been already published as we have selected the default option publish for the products imported from aliexpress so the products will get published to your website also so now let's go to the front end of the website here it's the soap page of your website and you can see that we have just imported these two products from aliexpress now the customer can also see these products on your website and can also purchase the product from your website so here the customer will select his options like size and then color and then can add the product to his card now for adding the product to the cart the customer can view his cart and can also check out from there so let's say you can see the product being added to the cart now we are going to check out so here the customer has to fill all his details Completing the details, we'll click on place order. Now you can see the order for the product has been successfully placed here. Now the admin can see 
the product folder in his admin panel as well. Now go to the admin panel of the website. Now the admin can see the orders under his WooCommerce orders tab for the Express folder. Click on WooCommerce orders. The admin can see the order here. Now the admin has to complete the order from the WooCommerce orders panel so that the product order will get assigned in the AliExpress orders from where the admin can place the order for the product on AliExpress. So first of all, we have to change the status of the order as complete completed here. As you can see, the product order here is in processing state. So now I'm going to change the status of the product as completed. You can see. The order has been completed so now we will go under aliexpress tab here and under the aliexpress orders to place the order on aliexpress the admin has to first login into his aliexpress account after login your account on aliexpress the admin has to just click on this place order button and now you can see the product been successfully added to the cart on aliexpress now you can see The product order is processing automatically we have just automated this process now here you can see the shipping details of the customer has been already integrated here to the checkout Now the admin can review the order here and here the admin has to just complete the payment, complete the order on AliExpress. So that's how you can import products from AliExpress and then can place an order for a product on AliExpress easily using our plugin so that's all for the today video tutorial thanks for watching the video please subscribe to our channel for latest video updates thank you